Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. In this video, guys, I'm going to show you how to fix top to wake not working issue in iOS 16. Fixing your iPhone top to not wake working issue with catwalk. So, whatever the reason is, I've got you covered. So watch this video until the end. Before we start the video, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more upcoming videos. So the first step is make sure that top to wake is enabled. For that you can go to settings, click on accessibility. Then click on touch and make sure that top to wake is enabled. So if it's turned off, make sure that you turn this on. After this, remove all lock screen widgets if you have added widgets. Sometimes too many lock screen widgets overlap and cause tap to wake not to work on iPhone. So make sure that you all on to the screen, click on customize and remove them. So there you can just click the minus icon and remove these. So once you have done this. And if it's still not working, then make sure that you restart your iPhone. For restarting, reboot your iPhone and resolve many typical iOS bugs. So if your iPhone has found lags, that will be solved. And after this, reset all setting of your iPhone. But then you can go to setting, click on general, scroll down, click on transfer and reset. And then click on reset. You can reset all setting and enter your iPhone passcode and click on reset all setting. And if it's still not working, then make sure that you update your iPhone to the latest version. For that, you can go to setting, click on general, and click on software update. And make sure that you update your iPhone to the latest version, which is iOS 16.3. So if there is any update available in the software update section, be sure that you update your iPhone. So if you have done all these steps and if it's still not working, then the last step is you have to factory reset your iPhone. By doing that, you will lose all of your data. So make sure that you make a backup of your iPhone. Then you can go to settings. Click on general, scroll down, click on transfer reset, and click on erase all containment setting. Make sure that you make a backup of your iPhone. By doing this, it can fix your problem. So hope this video helps you if it does and leave a like and comment. Thanks for watching.